Hello and welcome to Okuma's How To. My name is Jochen Andra. I'm the product specialist for multitasking machines and laces in Okuma. Today I'm going to introduce how to create 3D models for our CAS system for a tool holder and the ID turning tool. To do that, I'm going to use our easy modeling function on our controller. First of all, I want to create the tool holder and I'll make a new tool holder and I can choose the type of tool shank which I'm going to use in the machine. In this case it will be Capto C6 and our tool holder has an outside diameter of 75 mm and a total length of 115 mm and that's already enough to create a 3D model for our collision avoidance system. This holder I'm going to store under C6 minus 75 minus 50 by 115 and so I will identify it for further jobs whenever I'm going to use this tool holder. Next I want to create the cutting tool. So I will make a new tool and in this case it's a turning tool and it's an inside turning tool. And the tool direction of this holder is left, it's a left tool holder tool angle is 55 degrees and we have an edge angle of 3 degrees and a total tool length of the boring bar is 350 millimeters and the tool diameter of the shank is 50 millimeters and on the edge we have 62 millimeters and the nose radius is 0.4. The height of the tip is 5 millimeters. After that I have a simple model of the ID turning tool which I will use in our CAS system. We clearly can identify the yellow area, which is the cutting edge, and only with this cutting edge I can go into the material and remove the material. Also this tool I'm going to store under its name, which is A50U minus PDUNL 1506 minus D630. Then I have it in my tool library and can use it for any further jobs with this tool. After that, I must combine the tool and the tool holder in my tool library. To do this, I'm gonna first select the tool holder which I just created, which I find here, and I will select the tool which we created before. I will change the setting and the stick out length will be directly read from the tool data of the set tool in the machine. Now the model is ready to use in our collision avoidance system. Thanks for watching our video today. Check our other videos on our channels. If you have questions or you need further information, contact me and my team under info at okuma.eu.